Hey guys, it's Billy and welcome back to my ch -ch -ch channel. Yes, look at this like cool funky setup I have today, you guys. <clears throat> I'm really excited about this one. Oh, I feel like it's like so <coughs> interpersonal. Like it's just me and you like super close and like I just have my bowl of mac and cheese and with my cat, I have my guitar behind me. I have my fake plant behind me. As you guys know, I moved, I'm in my new apartment. So I'm just trying out new ways to film and i'm kind of like living for this i love this table i have it's like one of my favorite things i got it off amazon super cheap i got it a long time ago they probably still have it on there though <sighs> but i really really like this angle i always hate when my hair is cut off but <laughs> um today you guys oh, i want to like move back just a little more i feel like i'm gonna move back just like a smidge yeah there we go Today, oh, I wanted you guys to be closer to the food though, the struggle. Okay, I guess I'll eat it like this. Today, I'm eating Kraft mac and cheese. We're keeping it simple. Um, I made this, oh, hold on one second. Let me get like a thing, so hold on. Yes, the aesthetics, we're living for the aesthetics. Okay, that looks great, you guys. So yeah, I'm eating Kraft mac and cheese, just a normal plain Jane. It is lunchtime. It's like two o'clock here. I had a coffee. I'm feeling like a kind of like weak. I don't usually drink coffee, as you guys know. I might have mentioned it in one of my previous videos, but I gave up coffee and caffeine. Get down. But now, um, I like drink it every once in a while because I crave it and I love the taste of coffee. So I had one today. I'm like, you know when you get that shaky feeling, you don't eat? You drink coffee, that's how I feel. But, okay, let's eat. Mm. Yum. Mm. I bought a ton of packs of these because mm. 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 I missed them. Like, mm. I haven't had them in so long. So good. I usually will sometimes put sriracha on this, but not today. I do put pepper and onion powder in mine. Think of it more like flavor. Just a little bit. I don't want it to be like overbearing. I want it to still taste like cheese. But. Mm. Yes. How are you guys? Let me know in the comments down below how you are. I'm good. I've been like not depressed, but I've been like thinking about my life and I'm like, oh, what am I gonna do? And like today, I was really sick. For a little bit and you guys probably noticed like i didn't post and i'll do a post on like my sicknesses but my neck was like hurting me it might have been like a weather thing too like i was just in like a lot of pain i was super tired like headaches every fucking day and then i think like yesterday i started like feeling like myself again and like, I'm kind of disappointed in myself because in some of my videos, you guys probably noticed that I was losing weight and I was doing really, really well. And like, I was still doing well and I felt energetic and I felt happy and I was exercising and I kind of got off that. And it's just so hard. Like you start and then you're doing so good and then you get off and it's really difficult not to get like disappointed. But I'm sure we've all been there. But I think for 2020, like I need to like self-invest into myself, meaning like, I spend a lot of my money and like time on like stuff for other people or like things that aren't necessary. I need to just like oh, step it up. And I was telling my sister, I'm like, earlier today, I'm like, I just need to stop complaining and like start doing. And I think it's really difficult to do that. Like, but. I'm only like 26 years old and like I was reading this article about like millennial millionaires and I'm like oh. it's not about money though it's just like I don't know I just want to feel like successful I think we all do we all strive for like something more and like I think I'm like maybe I'm at the age where I'm like thinking like oh, I'm 26 like 
what am I striving to, like, for my 30, like, goals, you know? And I don't know if that's even, like, a healthy thing to do because then when you hit 30 and you don't meet that goal, you, like, get depressed. But mm, I guess it's just, like, part of life, you guys. It's just part of life. I put butter, milk, what else? Pepper and onion powder, and that's it. And I use the vegan butter, because I'm trying to be like healthy. The vegan butter is just as like good, I don't know. It's not margarine, I forget what it's made out of, but I got it because it's like non-GMO and like vegan, whatever. It's probably not even healthy, but. I really wanna try the McRib, but. There's none around here. And I was trying to find research and like, I don't know what areas the McRib came out in. If you guys let me know down below, but I've watched a lot of McRib mukbangs. I'm like, oh, that looks so good. Never had one. I've been getting a lot of hate. I'm like, how I chew. I'm like, oh, you gotta chew your mouth closed to get more subscribers and more views. I'm like, I don't care. Like, I don't even respond to it, but like, I don't care. Like, that's the thing. Like, I, I, I'm being myself. Like, I'm not gonna like sit here and pretend to be a different person. Like, I'm just not doing it. I'm not falling into that trap. Like, that's the whole point of my channel is like being real and like I'm not falling for like that fake crap. You don't like the way I chew then don't watch it. You know what I mean? Like I do this for me and for the people who do enjoy it and like get out of here. So that's a big disclaimer about my chewing. So you can stop like commenting right now about my chewing. <laughs> I can't believe it's like Thanksgiving already, you guys, almost. Like the holidays. For once, I already do my Christmas shopping mostly. I just have a few things to finish up. But I'm kind of proud of myself that, like, I'm, us I'm usually the last minute person who, like, buys everything, like, super last minute. Like, last minute meaning, like, I'm running around on Christmas Eve before the store's close. So that's that. I want to do what I think. Mm. What do you guys think about a Thanksgiving mukbang? I'm really thinking about doing it. Like, I thought about it. That was the first thing I woke up this morning. If you want to see a Thanksgiving mukbang, let me know. Comment. So I can see it. Like, I'm thinking like, and when you do comment, let me know what you want to be included. I was thinking like, I don't want too much, you know what I mean? Because it's, it's a lot cooking for like yourself, just by yourself. But I'm thinking like, turkey, obviously. Stuffing. cranberry sauce, mashed potatoes, and maybe like a vegetable, who knows, but that's like my plan, so let me know, I think it'll be fun, I'm trying to do more fun things, like you don't eat, so, you can only eat so much like McDonald's, you know, or like fast food. And if you're not from the U.S., like, do you have a food that 
Maybe it's like a traditional food that you have around family gatherings or stuff like that. That you maybe want me to try. My sister is making mac and cheese this year for at our Thanksgiving because a lot of people do have mac and cheese, like homemade mac and cheese for Thanksgiving, but my family usually doesn't make it. We have the boring. My mom's stuffing to die for though. I love stuffing. That's my favorite part of Thanksgiving. Ugh. Like, ugh. The bread and like my mom puts like apples and sausages in it. It's so good. Mm. Like not sausages, but like ground sausage. The good kind too, not like the shitty like Italian kind. I'm trying to get every last noodle. That like bothers me, like leaving a noodle in there. Because I hate seeing noodles in the sink. It like freaks me out. I hate wasting. This is so good, you guys. This was so awesome. Let's hit the spot. Like a good, good midday pick me up. All right, guys. You guys, I hope you liked hanging out with me. Don't forget to subscribe. You can like hit subscribe, like right this second. <laughs> and don't forget to share this with your friends who love mac and cheese. I actually love the spiral ones. Um, the reason, whole reason I did this too was because I was watching a Trisha Paytas video and she was doing the spirals. This is kind of a similar setup that she had. Um, but, mm, man, that was like, it hit the spot and it was just so convenient that I already had it. Um, don't forget to comment, share, subscribe. All of that jazz. I read every single comment. So, yeah. Um, so, I hope you guys liked hanging out with me. And I will see you on the next one. I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.